guys, it's Katie Hogan here. This is your sickest three minutes in fitness. I'm in Oahu, Hawaii. I'm here with Jack at CrossFit 50. And I'm gonna have him show us around his gym. Jack, what have we got here? Let's walk in and check it out. Come on in guys. This is CrossFit 50. I do it out of my place here in Kuleo Valley in Poi Kai. Um, here's our equipment. It's basically like your backyard then. It's our backyard. <laughs> um, we got a good amount of people we can fit in here though. We got 21 people that can do Olympic lifts at the same time. Double unders, pull ups and whatnot. Awesome. You guys um, are stacked with equipment. Tell me something about some of your equipment stuff. I like to do a big mix of barbell work, powerlifting work and mixed in with CrossFit. You know I do a lot of what I call extra credit. A lot of auxiliary work and I do a lot of specialty bars, a lot of specialty equipment and alcohol stuff. So with the extra credit, what does that mean? So the, cl the class comes in, you have them do a warm up, a workout of the day, and then how do they earn extra credit? So we have a, a specialty class called um, Cool Girls and Macadamia Nuts. It's kind of a play on hot dogs and cupcakes from Matt Chan. Um, that happens at 4 o'clock and you can hit your class there and they usually have a main, like a west side box squat workout. Okay. Then we hit your accessory work, um, some rec work. Um, if you don't want to do the west side barbell, you're kind of weird with that, a little scared. Mm -hmm. I have endurance work, which I have a running workout, a rowing workout, and even a swimming workout for the guys who get to the beach earlier wow. in the day. Um, and then guys will hit class at 515. And for those who get off of work really late, they're trying to rush to the gym and they get here at 515, they can perform the extra credit work after class. It's not really during a wad, but it's before or after. Okay, so they're just kind of tagging the stuff on extra, and you program that as well, yes. hoping that some of these athletes will kind of add yes. in extra stuff, get better, and that's where you focus on power lifting, west side, Olympic lifting technique there, and uh, endurance stuff, and then have yours like gymnastics ever too in that? Is it all the accessory stuff? I usually get the gymnastics work and with the Metcon, so you should pro program that in. Yeah. Um, it's kind of hard to keep it up with the extra credit because you're, pro you're um, programming, you know, running workouts, swimming workouts, rowing workouts, yeah. powerlifting workouts, Olympic workouts. So when you, I program one day, it's like programming four or five different workouts. So four or five days in one day. So yeah. programming takes hours for So you're a programming days. nerd for I'm sure. I'm a programming <laughs> nerd, yeah. <laughs> it's tough to do. I know a lot of people yes. come to me with programming questions and how do you balance it all. So congratulations to you with all that. Thank you. Must be pretty rough with this type of weather to be working out outside all the time. I'm sure everyone else on, on Sick Fit is jealous of what you guys got going on here. This is a poor man's glute ham raise from Sornex. Um, this will absolutely get your squats and everything else through the roof sumo deadlifts um, by working your hamstrings and your glutes and even partially the calves. Um, a lot of eccentric work will happen on this because the concentric is so hard on this. So what you do is you're gonna, go down. You're gonna lower yourself as slow as possible, catching yourself on the bench. Yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. And I give him a slight push and try to come up. Just a slight tug on the bench. And then assist up. Oh there we go. <laughs> See how my butt went back first? That's wrong. It's <laughs> not supposed to do. Yeah, but you did good. It's a rude hole. Yeah. It's like the ultimate hamstring Charlie Hoist brush. Seriously, five of these, you'd rather do a set of 10 by two squats. <laughs> oh, it just gives out. Oh nice. my God. That's really, really good. Most people just collapse. Those are terrible. <laughs> terrible. Awesome. I love it. Anytime I'm in Oahu, which is not as much as I'd like, this is where I come to work out. CrossFit 50. You guys have got to check it out. They've got all the stuff. They've got the best community ever. They've got uh, Chalk City, right? You guys are repping yeah. Chalk City. So uh, check them out next time you guys are out here. Thanks.